Hey family, this is Dr. Linda Burke, board certified OBGYN physician, blogger, and author of the Smart Mother's Guide to a Better Pregnancy. So I want to apologize to all of you. I have not been blogging uh, for a minute. I have been dealing with what I call Job moments in my life, sprinkled with Murphy's Law. So you can imagine some of the things that I've been going through, which I will share in the future once these challenges have passed. However, while I was reading the New York Times this evening, Sunday New York Times, a story about a pregnant woman caused me to pause, caused me to pull out this camera. You all know I do not like speaking in front of a camera, although I love speaking to y'all. Um, based on the content, the narrative of this story. In the state of Alabama, west of Birmingham is a town of 10,000 people called Pleasant Grove. And in Pleasant Grove, Unfortunately, two women got involved in a physical altercation. Uh, Sinead Jones was five months pregnant and uh, Ms. Jemison, uh, Ebony Jemison, uh, as a matter of fact, uh, got into an altercation over a man that they both work with. Things got very heated and it seems like Ms. Jemison, the, the woman who was not pregnant, shot Sinead Jones in the abdomen. Unfortunately, her five-month unborn baby died. Now here's where it gets really interesting. The woman who shot the pregnant woman was not arrested. The pregnant woman was arrested and is incarcerated as I speak because her five month unborn baby died. I'm having a problem with this y'all. I'm really having a problem with this. And as you know, Alabama is a state that considers an unborn child as having the same rights as a born person. So take home lesson for pregnant women. Don't get into a physical fight Definitely don't get into a physical fight with someone who has a gun because if that person shoots you and something happens to your baby, your unborn baby, and you, your baby dies, the person who shot you is not going to jail. You are. What do y'all think about that? I would love to get some feedback from y'all. And by the way, Pleasant Grove, the decision you made regarding Sinead Jones was anything but pleasant. Thank you so much, y'all, for listening. I want to hear from you and look forward to talking to you again.